Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Today is the first day of summer. I actually have kind of a busy day, I guess. Let me take a shower. BRB. Okay. I, it's like almost 9 o'clock. This is the fit of the day. I also got a new camera case thing. But I have this sweatshirt from J. Crew, and then just a Lulu white skirt. I think we'll just bring you along with the day. I'll try to show everything I do. Today we have graduation walkthrough at 10. I'm hanging out with my friend Liv after 2. I'm not really sure what we're doing. I have work at 3. It's pretty much it of my day. It's kind of busy kind of boring nothing too exciting um last day of school was yesterday i only went for an hour because none of my classes were doing anything so i said what's the point let me get ready and then i'll come back to you because i need to dry my hair and do my hair but let me collect my thoughts and think what this video will actually be my brother is still sleeping so that's why i'm quiet come on glail i'm just gonna let the dogs out Come on, Cleo, let's go potty. I guess on um, first day of summer I am super excited to be done with school but in two months I will be off to college and moving into my dorm so excited um, I'm going to my cabin for the 4th of July as I mentioned in the last vlog and then right after that I am going to Myrtle Beach in South Carolina with my cousin so it's just a girl's trip <laughs> Just a girl's trip. I have orientation actually in three days on Monday. I'm going down to Bama. Then um, I come back on Wednesday, have full day. Oh, and there's someone here. Okay, as I was saying, I have Bama next week. Then I'm going to Chicago that weekend. End of summer full of work and coaching tennis. What is up? I'm on my way home right now. Just got a giant slushie with my friend Liv. Gonna go home, chillax. I hate this intersection so much, but I don't have to deal with it anymore. Goodbye school. I just got back. I got a slushie. I'm on my way home. Graduation walkthrough was very um, long and very boring. I don't really know what to film. I just, it was kind of boring day because I have work at three, so there's nothing really to do. <sighs> Let's head in, bitches. This is the fit I'm gonna wear at work. These shorts, you've seen them in the last vlog. Um, Altered State, got them on sale. Super cute. And then such a J. Crew. Um, love the color. It was on sale 50% off as well. Oh my god, let me show you my shoes. They are so adorable my boyfriend got me a grad gift which is so sweet of him they're nike he's a big fan of nike but um they have cute little detailing on them little cute like cream yellow tone white and then like a little cute butterfly look at the inside just realized you can't shoot my shoes i do not the shoes they look so good. Oh my gosh, they look so cute. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Okay, first of all, go listen to Tate McRae's new album. Holy sh is that. Oh my god, I love her songs. So my favorite one is What Would You Do? Makes me feel like a bad bitch. Not gonna lie. But um, I am just a few minutes early to work. I just kind of like wanted to have a little moment, you know, just between you and me. That's awkward, really awkward, so. I kind of just wanted to talk about high school because I'm officially uh, done with high school. Our last day was yesterday and graduation is actually tomorrow. High school, geez, oh my gosh. Um, four years of my life that 
were a roller coaster. I'm not gonna say high school was fun. There was moments in high school that were fun. There were moments where I would love to believe that my high school was the place I always wanted to be at. Believe that people were actually there for me. Throughout the years were hard. Um, especially senior year for me was the hardest year of my life. There's people who were really mean to me and there's people who were really nice to me this year and I can't thank you enough. If high school isn't the thing that works out for you, college will be. It will be a completely different platform. My high school is once you're in a clique and you suddenly fall out of it, you will not have a group of friends anymore. And that's what I had. High school wasn't my thing. <laughs> and I hear that from a lot of people. I had great memories. Um, some of my old friends were very fun to hang out, some best friends. But this year I became the person I want to be. And that's, that's a pretty good thing because a lot of people don't have that. Yeah. And a lot of people don't like me, which it's okay, and I can, I can understandably w see why. That's a different story, and that's not my problem anymore. <laughs> this lighting's so good, actually. Not gonna lie. What's up, guys? Okay, I feel like I should set this up, but it's so awkward because people look at me. Oh. Hey, the lighting's probably so bad right now, but um, I just got done with work at like 7:05, which is like the fastest time I was ever out. I'm just kind of one-on-one. -on -one thing here again I made plans and we're going to noodles um excited I don't really know what to talk about um, my life is pretty decent I have seasonal depression so that is over now who wants to be depressed in summer I know I'll find a way somehow I don't know why friends don't have very many don't really care I've been hurt too many times to give them a second chance I've been over by so many people in my life and I gave them a second chance just to learn they'll hurt me again once someone f's me over you don't get a second chance it justifies that I can ignore you I don't give a blind freak that is my advice for anyone today who is done with BS because I am because this lady's going to Bama and she never has to see those stupid people again. Say that person is like someone you really care about. They f*** you over. Honey, it's one and done. It might happen again. And who would get a worse heartbreak if it happened again? This person right here. So we're not gonna do that anymore. I'm actually not this sassy. Um, shout out to this one girl in personal finance. She's gonna become my stalker. Um, hopefully she sees this. That would be funny. But she will be my stalker when I become famous. <laughs> <laughs> like, what if you become this huge influencer and I'm gonna be your stalker? <laughs> Go for it. I I think she's the sweetest, kindest girl ever and I adore her. She's so cute. But I'll see you guys after dinner, probably. Vlog a little one-to-one -one again just to update you guys of what's gonna be in my next videos. So, see you guys there. <laughs> Did I give this work? Oh. <laughs> Um, we got noodles. <laughs> You're gonna let all the heat out. <laughs> We're heading to Target. Okay, so it's about like 12 a.m. in the morning. And I'm gonna end the vlog here because I'm going to bed. Um, big plans coming up this summer. Super excited. And yeah, see y'all in the next video. Good night, guys. Kisses. Sophia Heidke. Mason Begel. Stephanie Halgerson. Maxwell Begel. Let's go. And as a symbol of your achievements and a new beginning, please move your tassel from right to left. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Minnesota's best graduated class of 2022. Stella.